Hey folks, it's Sal here, and uh, we're going to quickly install XBMC onto your Uya, Uya console. We're going to go to Make, Software, and then open up the browser. We're going to be entering a short code, and that'll be in the description of, the, of this video's description. And it's not very long to type in. So once we click on go, it's going to bring you right right to the link, right to the, the, and as you can see there, it says start downloading. So it brings you right to the file, and that's just going to download in the background. What we can do is go to manage, and then system, advanced, and we can check. If you scroll down to storage, we can check the progress of the download. Then we just uh, select downloads. And as you can see, uh, our um, our XBMC download is in progress, and uh, we're just going to let that go. So we will escape out of there, and um, we're actually going to do some uh, cutting and clipping, and uh, and bring you ahead to when the download is complete. Now, in order to install, you're going to have to go back into your download section. And the OUYA control pad controller has a touchpad on it. So what we're going to do is you're going to just touch the pad. And we're going to just tap on uh, XBMC. We're going to bring it up there. Tap on and it's going to actually uh, enable it uh, and ask us to download. Or sorry, install. We're just going to tap on install. Let it do its thing. Now, once the installation is complete, we're going to exit out. Uh, we're not going to run it right away. Uh, I just want to know where it can be found once we uh, once we go you know, from the main menu. So we're going to just exit out and start from the main menu. We're, we're, uh, let's, uh, we're going to check the play section where everything is downloaded. And it doesn't appear to be there. We'll do a screen refresh. And it's not there. So let's just back out of here. And we're going to try Discover. I don't think it's in here. This is the, um, I guess, the uh, OUYA online shop. Let's go down to Make Software. And there it is. It's in the software uh, section in the Make. So there it is, preparing to run for the first time. And this is, the, I believe this is the latest uh, edition of XBMC. So we're just going to explore the settings, uh, see it, see how it, um, what's in there. If uh... So this just explains, if it's your first time, the t side tab on the left. We're just going to be exploring right now. Get to check your video. Let's go down to, um, I believe, here. Here's where I'm going to add my UD, UP devices, like my uh, hard drive with the, that's running a media server on it. Just get the hang of this thing. So what you do is you select the um, media type that you want to um, Add to your share and just tap on um, OK once you're in there. But first, this is some more system settings there. So we're going to try it again. When we click on Browse, we're going to go down and select UDUP. I'm 
Mm, let's go back up. And just tap on OK with our touchpad. And then OK again. So it's going to auto discover. So uh, the, the OUYA right now is sitting on a different segment of my home network. So it's not going to pick up the, uh, the network media servers that I have running. So we won't be able to see that. But uh, I gotta say, it's uh, it's responding pretty quick. It's running really smoothly on here. Um, this is the weather app. If I can only change that to Celsius to metric, I wonder. I'm gonna I can't remember where that option is. If it's in the weather add-on. I know there's a configure. I'm going to have to revisit this if I don't find it now. But it looks like it's not here. It's not a big deal anyway. Look for it another time. But like I was saying, it's running really smoothly on here. It just looks really good. And um, let's exit out. Well, folks, that's how you install XBMC on your uh, Ouya console. Enjoy.